Very good Sunday afternoon to you folks, and I uh, hope you're enjoying the beautiful weather that we have today, and uh, some of us may be looking more forward to fall, and I do include myself in that category. Um, and those of us that are fans of more fall-like weather that kind of want to see maybe a little bit more rain, some cooler temperatures, will be in luck, uh, as we will have a shift in our weather pattern. But first, I want to show you what's going on for the rest of the weekend into the beginning of your work week. Now, we do have this strong southerly flow, which is really making it feel pretty warm. Notice these winds coming out of the south. But I want to direct your attention right now to about eastern Alberta and this cold front that's associated with this low, uh, and again, about uh, eastern Alberta. That's going to continue to move off towards the east, and this cold front, notice there's a shift in the winds behind it. Now start to come from the northwest. Well, that's going to continue to work its way towards our area and give us even a stronger northerly flow. And then check this out, going into about Tuesday morning, even a couple chances for a few spotty showers and uh, widespread cloud cover. So certainly going to feel a stark contrast from what we had today. Now temperatures right now, I was saying how it feels like uh, you know, a very beautiful day out there right now. Temperatures in about the mid to upper 60s, even in some places in the mid 70s. Uh, 72 in Bismarck, 74 in Dickinson. This is as of 2.30 in the afternoon on Sunday. But cooling it down tonight, not quite as much as uh, we should be seeing this time of year, as a lot of us will be in about the low 40s, a couple upper 30s. Uh, likelihood of any places really hitting below the freezing point, pretty low tonight. But of course, we'll keep you updated. And we'll have more tonight on KX News at 10. And be sure to join us, and we'll see you then.